Hi, my name is Dr. Murray. I'm a professor here at Bakersfield College, and there's no one around, so I'm going to take my mask off for now. I'll keep it close at hand. All right, so my name is Dr. Murray, but when you're a student here, we go by first name basis, so you can call me Paul. And I'm a first generation student. I came from a small town in Canada. It was a farming community about the same size as Arvin, California. All right, what I'd like to do is I'd like to take you inside the lab and show you around a little bit. So let's go take a look. All right, we're inside what we call the SIM lab. And SIM, C-I-M, that stands for Computer Integrated Manufacturing. And as you take a look around here, the first thing you may notice is the lab looks pretty congested. There's a ton of stuff in here. Uh, don't worry about it being congested because they're busy building us a brand new building next door. And in a year or so, we're gonna move into that new building and we're gonna have a, a big spacious lab. It's gonna be great. But for now, this is our, our sim lab where we do a bunch of different things. And basically we've crammed around a million dollars worth of equipment into this one small room where we can do a bunch of, of different experiments and hands-on training. For example, here, this is, we call this a trainer. And these are all different lights and buttons that do different things when you press them. We use that for testing our programs when we program the PLCs. Here's a PLC up here and another one beside it. And we have something like, I think 30 or 40 different PLCs in this lab. So when we do PLC programming, we write our programs, we download them into the PLC, and then we actually test them with physical things in the lab. So we do some theory in these courses, but we do a lot of hands-on training, and that makes it really interesting. If you look over here, we've got a process simulator where we do a lot of different experiments with. I think you're going to really enjoy coming here and, and learning how to do industrial automation, and it's really the way of the future, and welcome to BC. Thanks.